So the time now is 6.52. As NHS figures show worsening mental health among teenagers, researchers are urging the government to include life skills in the curriculum of English secondary schools. It follows a pilot study which taught students skills and techniques to help them navigate the pressures of growing up. Here's more from our home editor, Mark Easton. Slowly in, slowly out. For year seven, today's lesson is on how to breathe. Get your backs up, right? This class at Chancellor's School in Hertfordshire has just begun a four-year study programme teaching them the skills and techniques for a happier and healthier life. It's just as hard as maths, I always think, this, this, this lesson, because you need to try and try and try these techniques to perfect them. With mental health and behavioural problems among secondary pupils worsening, dozens of schools across England have been testing an evidence-based programme using theories from positive psychology. What if the other person wants something else? You need to be able to like negotiate and compromise with someone so that they can have what they want and then you can have what you want. Weekly hour-long lessons on social and emotional learning, relationships, resilience and mindfulness designed for young people aged 11 to 15. Does it work? These are very hard skills. Some, some adults struggle with these, by the way. Academics compared the well-being of pupils who completed the course with a control group which didn't participate. The results are really quite impressive. Evaluation suggests a significant increase in children and young people's general health and an improvement in life satisfaction that's equivalent to an adult finding a partner. As a sufferer of anxiety, it has really helped as the uh, coping the mechanisms that we're taught um, has been effective in everyday life. It really helped me with exam stress and working through any issues I had like on top of school and the pressure of dealing with exams. There was definitely problems with academic stress, friendship groups and also personal problems which I've been able to deal with in a more practical and uh, I'd say successful way. We're going to have a quick roundup of the lesson. Teachers must complete a week of intensive training before delivering lessons, a process that some found positively life-changing. We actually had to test all of these theories we were learning about on ourselves. So I, mean, I personally found out an awful lot about myself, things that I've actually been carrying around unknowingly since my own childhood, issues that I've got. Thanks, the experts behind the scheme say the results are so impressive and the cost so low, £25 a year per pupil, it should be part of the curriculum in every secondary school, not just in Britain, but around the world. Mark Easton, BBC News, Hertfordshire.